my heart is shattered. Crystal Lawson says just last week she was in Haiti. To land here days before the hurricane came to Haiti, I felt so guilty because I wasn't there to um, be with them. Lawson is the founder of Hugs from God. Her organization is dedicated to helping the small villages in Haiti that are often overlooked. She says her church family in Haiti has been sending her pictures of the devastation from Tuesday's storm. And these people are starving, so I have to feed them every day by the water and the food so that they have the strength to even be able to work. The work Lawson does would usually take a whole village, but she says typically it's just her, which can sometimes get rough. Honestly, a lot of times it's just been me and God. She started the mission after the 2010 earthquake. Since then, her group has helped a lot of people, rebuilding homes and schools. But now she says some of the villages she's worked with are back to square one. The, the small two-room school that we have just finished building, um, it, that village was what was hit so hard. Lawson says she's been in the process of building a church that could act as a shelter, but they weren't able to get it finished in time for the storm. She says this time she knows it's going to take a lot. You can't turn away from it. I know them, and they're waiting for that miracle, and I can be a part of that miracle. We can be a part of that miracle. For now, Lawson says her focus isn't to travel back down to Haiti right now, but to send them as much supplies as she can. She says 100% of the donations made to Hugs from God will go directly to the people impacted by the storm. In Lexington, Sabir Rayford, WKYT.